This is the Enride's T-Pod, an electric autonomous vehicle that has been compared to a Zamboni machine, a stormtrooper from Star Wars, and, less creatively, to a container on wheels. But when we looked at the vehicle exhibited at the Smart City Expo in Atlanta, we saw self-driving transport vehicle written on one of its sides. And this sounds just like the right definition. What makes the Tipo unique compared to other vehicles in the same category like the Tesla Semi or Nikola is that this vehicle does not have a driver's cabin or a driver's seat. Enride positions itself as a software and operational company rather than a transportation company. That's one of the reasons why the vehicle is presented at digital trade shows like the International CES or South by Southwest, for example. We would not be surprised to see the same track at a toy fair, as especially with the introduction of 5G technology, the Enride can also be driven remotely just like a remote-controlled toy car. With the T-Pod, however, one user can remotely drive more than one vehicle at the time. Enride began daily freight deliveries for the first time on a public road in Sweden last June. The goal is to have 200 vehicles in operation by the end of 2020, transporting goods from warehouse to warehouse, or from ports to warehouses, among other options in logistics. Enride was at the event in Atlanta hoping to do business partnerships with U.S. companies. In Europe, the Swedish startup has agreements with European companies like tire manufacturer Michelin, German grocer Lidl, Swedish delivery company Svenska, and a half a dozen retail companies in the Fortune 500. But according to the founders of the startup, it is in the United States that autonomous tracks will scale more rapidly. T-Pod has an electronically limited top speed of 85 kilometers per hour or 53 miles per hour. During testing period, the limits are set by the Swedish transport agency to 5 kilometers per hour or 3 miles per hour. T-Pod is a level 4 self-driving vehicle that can also be controlled remotely by a human operator. It is equipped with multiple cameras, radars and leaders. The vehicle uses a 200 kilowatt battery. Not having a cabin, according to the company, reduces road freight operating costs by around 60% versus a diesel truck with a driver. The weight is 25 tons when fully loaded. Enride claims that the T-Pod can drive up to 200 kilometers, 124 miles, on one charge while carrying 15 pallets of goods. And at the time of making this video, Enride announced it raised $25 million from investment funds backed by names like Panasonic, Honda, Omron and the Japan Bank for International Cooperation. Robert Falk, CEO and founder of Enride, said that the funding will allow us to start expanding in the US, deliver on our technology roadmap and to meet rapidly increasing customer demand.